first citizen, Mary Curcio. Please come forward, state your name and your address for the record, please. Hello, um, my name is Mary Curcio. I live at 3845 Kinderloo Forest in Valdosta. Um, for at least a year, we've been, um, my neighborhood has been having an issue with advanced disposal. Um, they are the current company that owns the Evergreen Landfill that is off of 84. Um, I've lived in Valdosta since 2005. I've only lived in Kinderloo since then. When Veolia owned the landfill, there was not a problem with an odor at all. Um, maybe two times in five years that they owned it, there was a problem. Um, at least for the past year and a half, since advanced disposal has had that landfill, there have been multiple times, at least weekly, that my house smells like methane. Um, the neighborhood smells like, for lack of a better word, death. <laughs> um, it is just a horrible, wretched smell that if you leave in the morning and you come home at the end of the day, your house still smells like that. And I, I just, I find that unacceptable for many reasons. Um, one, mainly for um, the health of my children, the health of my family, my property value. Um, like I said, I, I moved here in 2005 and I love this town and I plan on being here for the rest of my life. I don't wanna see it ruined by a company that has come in and taken over and is not doing the proper things. I don't know that they're not doing the proper things. My gut and my nose tell me they aren't. You know, um, Veolia, like I said, did not have issues with keeping the smell at bay. Um, I've approached our homeowners association. We had a lady who no longer works at Kinderloo. Um, her name was Margaret Ann Newsom. She was in constant contact with a gentleman by the name of Gary Walk. And he assured her, and I have an email to back it up. I can give you all the copy of the email um, that it would be taken into consideration. They were working on fixing the problem, and this was back in March. He said, please give him a month to take care of the situation. It has clearly been over a month. Ms. Newsom is not with us anymore. Um, I have tried to contact Advanced Disposal. They will not reply to my emails. I have Gary Walk's cell phone number. He will not respond to me. Um, they haven't fixed the problem, and now they aren't even listening to the complaints of the residents. And I'm asking you all to please put pressures on them. Um, I've even contacted the EPA. They won't call me back either. Uh, <clears throat> excuse me. But I would like you to put pressure on them to make sure they're following the rules. Um, it's not okay for our neighborhoods to smell like this. I know there are people in Lockwin that live off of 84 that also have the same issues with smell. Um, I was in town at my veterinarian's office, which is up by Chile, so Bornto and Bay Tree, and it stunk up there. So I know it's not just an 84 problem. I know it's not just one part of the town that smells. You know, it's it's a town-wide problem. And like I said, I, I worry for the health of my children and for myself. And I don't want to see Valdosta just, you know, overcome by advanced disposal and their lack or inability to run the landfill like they're supposed to. Okay. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you. Thank you for coming.